The first one in this list is uh, Gmail bot. I use this bot to handle my emails inside Telegram. This is so useful for me because I check my Telegram more often than I check my mails. You can start the bot after authenticating your Google account. Once you start getting the emails, you can simply download the email attachments in a click and you can also send a reply. You can also tweak the bot as per your requirement by sending the settings command. This can save a lot of time and prove very useful to you. Fake mail bot is another great service which I use. This bot generates fake emails which you can use to register on various platforms. This not only keeps your main email account clean but also prevents spam. This bot has two options, generate and set. By sending generate, it will give you a random fake email ID. Whereas when you will use set, you can get a customized email address using your name or your domain. Which is pretty decent in my opinion. To get a list of email IDs which you have currently registered under this bot, simply hit IDs and it will give you a list of all the IDs which is registered in your account. Next up is News in Shorts. Being a subscriber of this channel, being a developer of this channel actually, I can say that I made it because I needed a service which sends the latest news update in a short and concise manner. Every news update sent contains the link of the post from where this news is fetched. So you can also check the website in case you need detailed information about the news. Okay, so this channel is based on my open source unofficial InShorts API which is currently available on my GitHub. So in case you want to build your amazing service based on this, you can use that free API. The next bot which I use on daily basis is the music downloader. This bot needs no introduction as the name is self-explanatory. This bot is capable of downloading and sending songs on Telegram in 320 kbps quality by searching songs by its name, artist name, album name, movie name, lyrics or even by the voice message of these. At the time of making this video, the bot has sent over 1 million songs to users across the globe. To use this bot, simply hit start and it will reply with a fancy message. To start searching songs, just enter the song name. It will start fetching the most appropriate songs for this keyword. Please wait until it fetches all the songs related to that keyword query and then it will reply with a list of songs having that name. Once the list is fetched, all you need to do is simply click on the song name which you want and it will instantly send the song along with a fancy message. Almost all the songs sent by the bot contains id3 tags along with the lyrics embedded in the songs. So that's a good bonus to have. As I mentioned previously, the bot also supports song links. So let's try with some links. Let's see. Wow, it works instantly. That's great. Now let's try another service. We will just share this from here. But this time we will not share it with Musify. We will share it with the bot. Let's see. It's processing. And yeah, we got the song. That's great. Meet Friday, my personalized user bot which handles my day-to-day -day tasks. 
Friday is capable of doing normal tasks which most of the other user bots like Unibog, Userg, Paperplane, Friendly Telegram do and the majority of the features of Friday are cherry picked from them. I won't waste time discussing those features. So let's see some unique stuff that makes Friday a personalized user bot. Friday is always synced with my laptop so it can perform operation on files and also share it over cloud or over telegram. To check the status, I simply enter dot sync status and it replies with the sync status. Currently, you can see it successfully synced with my laptop. To achieve this cross sync between my server and my laptop, I have used R clone, as most of you might already have guessed. I am also using Friday for home automation. Friday can control the electric equipments of my home. Friday can turn my fans, LEDs, etc. on and off. To do that, I just enter switch fan on and it replies and now it's switched on. Similarly, I will just turn switch fan off and it will now turn it off. Great. To do this, I have used IFTT module and I'm controlling it with the webhooks. So I have simply created a webhook for the equipments which is linked to IFTT modules and now I can control it to turn it on and off and also do various stuffs like changing a bulb's color, setting it to a maximum brightness and stuff like that. So it becomes very handy to control all the equipments using Telegram inside the bot. Have you ever wondered where to watch a movie or a TV show? Friday helps me in determining on which streaming sites a particular movie or a TV show is available. To search that, I simply type dot watch and then I enter, no not Pahubali, I will enter endgame. Let's see, it will, okay, it's very quick. It just found the list of available websites on which I can stream the endgame movie and its direct link of that. No, I don't have iTunes subscription. No, I don't have Google Play subscriptions also. I can watch it on YouTube or on Hotstar. These links are direct links. And whenever you will open it, it will simply open it in the Hotstar app. Okay, so let's try it on another movie. For example, okay, this time Bahubali. And yeah, it will fetch all the sites on which the Bahubali is available. As you can see, these are direct links. Wait, it saves much time. I have also added a price tracker script on Friday so it can notify me whenever a price of a particular product which I have already added in a tracking list goes down. It will help me save a lot of money. So I will just add a product to the tracking list by entering in this format. I'm using a link of a Flipkart pen drive and it will run the script and it will reply me whenever the successful yeah it's successful now so the current price which you can see is 639 I will just uh, open it once to verify yeah the price as you can see is 639 so it's working fine and it has added that product in my tracking list. So whenever the price of this product will go down, it will notify me as a message. This is the feature is still in beta, but I'm trying to add more support for Amazon, Mintra and third parties too. I have not found any useful APIs which can do that. So in case I am successful in implementing all these tracking scripts, I will make an API and release it openly on my GitHub. So stay tuned. Friday also tracks all the products which I am using and it helps me in tracking all the list of services which I am providing and whether it's working or not. To do that, I just simply enter is up and then it fetches all the sites and services which I am using and it notifies me. Okay, so it's showing databases down. Okay, and then uh, Friday add-ons is all, also down. In Friday add-ons, I am writing a script 
विच करंटली आई एम ट्राइंग टू इम्प्लीमेंट द होल इंस्टाग्राम फीचर ऑन टेलीग्राम सो वॉट इट कैन डू इट कैन कंट्रोल ऑल ऑफ माई इंस्टाग्राम थिंग लाइक लाइकिंग अ पोस्ट एंड गेटिंग ऑल द पोस्ट आई एम एंड देन ऑल्सो कॉमेंटिंग समथिंग ऑन दोज फोटोज फ्रॉम लिंक एंड फैचिंग ऑल द यूजर डिटेल्स सो आई एम ट्राइंग टू एड ऑल दोज फीचर्स इन द फ्राइडे एड ऑन्स एंड आई एम नॉट श्योर इफ इट्स स्टिल वर्किंग और नॉट इट्स स्टिल इन वेरी वेरी अर्ली स्टेजेस बट आई विल ट्राई टू इम्प्लीमेंट इट एंड इंटीग्रेट इट इन साइड द यूजर बॉड ओके सो आई विल क्विकली चेक वेदर द बेसिक इम्प्लीमेंटेशन ऑफ दिस टू फैच अ यूजर्स अकाउंट डिटेल इज वर्किंग और नॉट सो फॉर दैट आई विल जस्ट सिंपली राइट डॉट इंस्टा एंड प्रोवाइड द यूजर नेम ऑफ दैट अकाउंट and it works friday uses chatbot and learns my chatting style every day and i will use my train model to implement automatic replies using artificial intelligence you can have a look at the chatter bot module and start coding your own bot which can learn your chatting style and reply to your users in your style thanks for watching and share and subscribe for more such videos